Over the past month, I have been living my life differently to how I usually do. All in an effort, all in an effort to finding purpose. Here's my story of those last 30 days. Holy hell. The first thing I had to adapt to was my morning routine, which was focused around my health. 6 a.m. starts, face cleaning rituals, going for a walk or run immediately with the dog, workout after that, supplements, and then head to work with a fresh mind. During the day, I was all about remembering to fuel the body and my mind. The way I did this was I was counting my calories and my macros. During the afternoon, this is when I would work on something for the soul. For the soul. Uh, which I broke down to editing content, time management, accountability, and having a little bit of fun on the side. What are you winking about? <laughs> and this is the result. Good morning, good morning. Right to the milkmaid. Oh, water! The milkmaid of the law. Dr. Tenana over there. I'm going to be doing our cooking on one day. Um, I have all the calories here of what I'm going to be getting. Some of the main things are oats, eggs, mints. That's pretty much it, to be honest. It's not a lot. As you can see, all the eggs are cleaned out. So you have to figure out what we're going to have to replace eggs with. It's not a whole lot of anything, to be honest. 1,150. That'll do. Oh, fuck. Alright. Almost finished. Look at that shit. Make you want to burst five. So it's pretty much my dinner prep for the week. I think in the future, I'm definitely gonna try and find some leaner mints. We'll just start using some chicken in the, um, and for lunches. For my mum's birthday. So instead of buying us something, we can clean up the household. We got the bathroom, uh, the shitty situation. <laughs> So, what was the outcome? Did I find my purpose? Not exactly, no. no. <laughs> We're still oh. working. <laughs> We're still working on that. <laughs> However, there are two things that I did get out of it that I want to keep doing. The first one is I really want to continue doing this for the year. I want to see how far I can push my body and see where my limits are. At the moment, you know, I feel quite good to be honest. My limits have definitely come back towards this way, but there's still some there. The second thing that I want to take into the year, I'm going to be starting a new series called Tour 100. No copyright. Don't strike me. So the first episode will be dropping soon, um, and that's going to obviously going to give you more details about Tour 100. However, the main purpose of this, if Physical 100 was to ever come to New Zealand, 
I want to be strong enough, well known enough, and sexy enough that I would be chosen as a participant. Obviously, we've got a lot of work to do. But yeah, that's that's the main reason for Tour 100 is really pushing my limits and finding out how far I can push this body. Anyway, thank you very much for watching my journey. Look forward to the next episode. And I'll see you guys then. Peace. Bye-bye.